This week, we received the one millionth vote, an amazing milestone that reflects the discomfort from coast to coast about Washington's runaway spending spree. The goal of UCUT is simple, and it should not be a novel concept on Capitol Hill. Stop spending and start cutting. It took 43 American presidents from George Washington to George W. Bush for us to accumulate $5 trillion in debt. This Congress and this administration unambiguously are tripling that number in a decade. The American people are speaking out, and I'm listening, that they're tired of spending. House Republicans are fighting back with a new program called You Cut where the American people can participate in voting themselves to cut spending and to save their children money. And I think by this you cut vote, what Americans are saying is enough is enough. And we've heard a lot about the past and whose fault it is, quite frankly, over the last week. I didn't hear anybody wanting to cast blame. They want people to solve problems. That's what they've sent us here to Washington to do. So what the Republicans have done in an attempt to be fiscally responsible and, and try to encourage our colleagues on the other side of the aisle to stop the madness is to institute the UCUT program. It's at republicanwhip.house.gov slash UCUT. House Republicans are offering a way to cut spending not tomorrow, not next week, but right now with UCUT. The next five cuts are already up on our site. Please continue to cast your votes each week. They are making a difference.